Hello everyone, I'm Mark with MainWP, and this is an overview of the MainWP Post SMTP extension. The MainWP Post SMTP extension was built in partnership with Post SMTP by WP Experts, and it allows you to automatically utilize the Post SMTP configuration on your MainWP dashboard or parent site with all of your MainWP child sites. The MainWP Post SMTP extension is free to use and can be downloaded directly from the WordPress repository. In this brief video, we will show you how to install and use the extension. It assumes that you have the Post SMTP extension installed and sending mail from your parent site, along with the MainWP Child plugin installed on all of your child sites. If you have not installed and configured your Post SMTP extension on your parent site, you can find an installation guide at postmansmtp.com slash documentation. Let's go ahead and take a look at the extension now. As mentioned earlier, you're going to want to go ahead and go to your plugins on your parent site and make sure that your Post SMTP plugin is installed and configured. An easy way to check to see if your Post SMTP plugin is configured is to go to your Post SMTP dashboard. And if it's configured correctly, you'll see a message that says Postman is configured. Once you have confirmed that Post SMTP is working properly on your parent site, go to plugins add new and do a search for post SMTP main WP. Look for the plugin that says main WP post SMTP extension and install it. Once installed, click activate. Once activated, there is no further configuration of this plugin needed. The next step is to install the post SMTP plugin on your child site. Hover over MainWP and go to Plugins. From here, select Install Plugins from the sidebar or the Install tab up above. In the Search Plugins, type in Post SMTP and hit Enter. Select Install Plugin and then choose the site upon which you'd like to install the Post SMTP plugin. Make sure you have Activate After Installation and Overwrite Existing Version turned on and then click Complete Installation. Once complete, click Close and then synchronize your sites. Once your sites are synchronized, select Extensions and verify that your Post SMTP extension is enabled. Next, select the main WP Post SMTP extension. From here, if you have multiple sites, you can either select Enable All Sites, or you can manually toggle each site on. Once enabled, click Save. You've now configured your child sites to use the Post SMTP configuration on your parent's site. This next step is optional. If you would like to test the functionality of your child's site, go to Site, Plugins, Install, and enter Contact Form 7, and then Enter. Choose the child site upon which you have just installed the Post SMTP plugin, and select Complete Installation. Once complete, synchronize your site. From here, go to your child site and you'll notice that there is now the Contact Form 7 plugin installed. Go to Pages, add a new page, and let's name it Contact Form. From here, you can use the block and just type Contact and you can just add the Contact Form right here and then click Publish. Once published, you can view the page and you can enter some test information. Once you've done that, hit the submit, and you'll see that the message has been sent. To verify that the child site is using the parent site for its post SMTP configuration, go to your parent site WordPress dashboard, select post SMTP, and then choose email log. You should see a success message reflecting that the message you sent from your contact form was delivered properly. 
By using the POST SMTP plugin with the MainWP POST SMTP extension, utilizing your preferred email service and having centralized logging has never been easier. Thank you for joining us to discover the simplicity and strength of integrating the MainWP dashboard with the MainWP POST SMTP extension. We are excited to continue offering you innovative and robust solutions for WordPress management. Stay tuned for more empowering tools and updates in the future.